So there is a template that we have for still graphics. So you go ahead, go down, and you'll see there's one right here that's uh, still graphic, and there's also one for Twitter if you need to accent a, uh, a tweet maybe somebody had said. But we're gonna use the one for uh, still graphic. It's a bigger image, which is a little bit of a background on the left and right. Select it, click, hold, drag, and drop it into the gray area, which is the sequencer. So you're gonna click on photo, and you're gonna go to the folder. Hold on. Click on photo, and you go to the folder, and make sure you navigate to the folder you want. Now, you wanna make sure on the bottom here, it shows image files, not video files, if you were doing anything with uh, graphics before. So click on image files and navigate to the folder you want. Let's say it'll be this one here. And maybe I want to do something with, you know, um, the Boeing 730s Max. All I gotta do is double click on the photo and it'll automatically go right to the template that you want it to go to. If you need more photos, just simply repeat and then you could add your photos into the show. Now with photos, since those are still images, you may need to change the output. Expression uh, brings images up right away, but we also have two still picture channels that we may need to utilize as well. So just consult with your director or your uh, technical director as to where it should go, either in the expression, which is the uh, full-blown, you know, uh, right away channel, or still one or still two. Now, if you choose one of these, and you have to bring up multiple pictures back to back, just keep in mind it takes about two seconds to load after you hit enter when you want that picture to be set to air.